Hi, I'm Trevor Strutt. I'm a registered osteopath and I'm 53 years young. I started training for osteopathy back in 1993 and graduated back in 1997. So I've been in private practice for 23 years now and I can honestly say I love my job. Um, Confucius says, choose a job that you love and you'll never have to work a day in your life. And um, that has been paid out for me throughout my career to date. Um, I began my working life uh, as a, um, a sports director for Princess Cruises. So I was um, having a whale of a time out on the high seas around the Caribbean. And whilst doing so, unfortunately, I prolapsed a disc in my back, which means that here's a disc here, here's, here's the spine. Uh, I burst the disc, which then pressed onto the nerve. And unfortunately, that led to paralysis down my leg. Um, and that was the a chance for me to reflect on what I was doing with my life. And then at age 24, I decided to get a proper job and come and train as an osteopath. The practice where I work now is um, in Crawley. It's uh, right by Gatwick Airport. And uh, we've built up to a big team of uh, multidisciplinary health practitioners. And we specialize in osteopathy and Pilates rehabilitation. And these are the fabulous people I work with. I wanted to train to be an osteopath because I always enjoyed health and fitness growing up and always very active and it really pushed me towards osteopathy because it meant that I could help people, it was a very hands-on career along with having health and fitness alongside that. Um, the reason why I love working in a multidisciplinary clinic is because you get the support from everyone else around you. Because every osteopath is different, so you get to learn off each other from their skills and what they've learned, but also from the other clinicians like the acupuncture therapist, foot health, massage, and then at Pilates as well. So I feel like it's really been able to tie everything together, and a lot of patients have benefited from that, because if you can't help them in one way, someone else can, and it's so nice to have someone there that you can refer across to for support. It's a beautiful job if you are uh, a caring person and willing to help um, and you, you love seeing the result of your actions, interacting with people and it gives you a great deal of freedom, uh, personal satisfaction and it's a very rewarding job. Uh, there are plenty of great clinics out there, you can work for yourself. Um, Certainly at first I think it's worthwhile having uh, support around you and having experienced practitioners nearby um, and you can meet some great people, everyone in this profession is, uh, seems to be a great person and doing it for the right reasons and um, I'd encourage anybody who wants to have a go, um, don't be misconstrued that it's easy, um, it's not, it's tough and, but very much worthwhile. Hi, I'm Dan Wilkinson, registered osteopath. So I've been graduated just over two years now and I did a four year integrated master's course at the International College of Osteopathic Medicine at Nescott, which is affiliated with Kingston University. Um, so I, become, I wanted to become an osteopath um, because I've been treated since a young age, uh, played lots of sport when I was growing up and from there um, I get injured quite a lot and from there I found that osteopathic treatment was the most effective for me. Um, so I get treated by my osteopath, Trevor Strutt, at Bridge and Click. Um, and then from there, it was kind of inspired me to, to get into this profession. Um, I also work here at Bridge and Click, um, as well as a performing arts school, art educational school up in Chiswick in London, uh, which obviously is a musical theatre musical college. Um, I also have a home clinic as well. The best thing about my job is obviously the helping people, I think that's the main reason why we all do it. As well as that, it's meeting people from various walks of life. I'm quite fortunate that with the various places I work, I treat people from all different backgrounds, from the dance stuff in London, to a lot of rubber players at home, and to people here at Bridgham. Um, yeah, enjoy it all. Good morning, my name is Reino Moreno. I'm an osteopath. I started, I started studying osteopathy in 2010. Uh, at the British School of Osteopathy. I graduated in 2014. I've been an osteopath for six years. Um, I love osteopathy. I, I, uh, previously I was in, in, in 
public relations, so I'm used and comfortable around people, but as, as an osteopath, you not only you get to treat them and make them better, you also get to speak to them and, and, and you know, get to know them. And, and there are many ways in which you can help people, and, and I think with osteopathy, a lot of boxes are ticked. So I encourage everyone that wants to do osteopathy to go ahead and do it. It's, 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 you're going to be helping quite a lot of people in pain, and, and you're going to make it the world a better place. Um, I work um, at a multidisciplinary clinic in, in Crowley, Bridge of Osteopathy. I also work, uh, I'm the director and founder of Moreno's Osteopathy in Southeast London, and I'm on the process of expansion. Um, it is a good, it's a beautiful job anyway, uh, as it is, but um, it's a very rewarding job. And uh, I encourage anyone that would like to be an osteopath to, to try it because uh, you won't be disappointed.